Jingle bells, jingle bells, jingle all the way. Oh, what fun it is to ride in a one horse. Hey YouTube, what is up? It is a Tuesday afternoon. I got home from school about an hour ago. It is like 3.30, 3.35. So yeah, my mom actually came home. Um, I didn't see her when I came, but she went. She had a doctor's appointment, and she brought me Robex smoothies. I love Robex smoothies. Um, this is in strawberry, just plain strawberry. It's been my favorite smoothie. They make such good ones there. Oh my gosh, like seriously, so good. So I've just been drinking this. And when I came home, I also found that the book I ordered from Amazon came. It's called Outliers. I've heard a few good things about it um, online and stuff. And basically, it's by um, Malcolm Gladwell, if you guys are wondering. I know he's written a few other books, um, but I wanted to read this one first because I've heard the most about this one. And if I like his style, then maybe I'll read the other ones. But basically, it's just his story on success, as it says on the book. But it's just, I think it's going to be talking about mostly about, like, why different people succeed, how other people succeed, and, like, ways to succeed, um, even if it's, like, small goals, big goals. So um, it's just, like, one of those books where um, it's based on like the brain and like the way your brain handles things and the way you interact with people. So similar to MindWise, but this is more on people in general rather than like individuals. So at least that's what I think. I don't really know too much about the book. Like I said in my previous vlog from yesterday, I don't really like to analyze the books too much before I read them because if I read the full-on summary then I feel like I've already read the book and it just kind of takes out all the fun in reading at least that's what it is for me like half the time like I'm at a bookstore and I read like the entire back cover and I read a few pages and I feel like I've already read the book which just kind of ruins the whole thing because it's like someone telling you basically an entire summary of a show and it's like you watch one or two episodes and then you kind of get sick and tired of it it's kind of like it's kind of like gossip girl like you kind of know what's gonna end up happening in each episode but it's still fun to read but so read it's still fun to watch so yeah right now i'm basically doing nothing um later i'm gonna go work out i'm gonna be doing kickboxing maybe with my friend erica maybe not i'm not sure um so we're just gonna see but i'm definitely gonna go and yeah, that's why I'm wearing workout clothes. I did not go to school like this. I did not wake up like this by Beyonce. Um, but right now, I'm doing nothing. I'm so bored that I'm watching a video of Justin Bieber on the Ellen show, just greeting fans for the first time and like like huge fans. It's pretty entertaining to watch these girls goes to watch these girls go like berserk over him surprising them. But I mean, I would too, honestly. Like if, if it was Taylor Swift, and I was talking a lot about Taylor Swift to like a whole like camera crew and then just have Taylor come up behind me like I would probably react the same way so yeah what do you guys think about this camera quality by the way I keep looking up here and I'm sorry it's just that like usually my viewfinder is like to the left and I've gotten good at like not looking at it but since this is literally right above the lens it's hard to not like look up every now and then um but yeah what do you think about the quality and like the sound do you think do you think it's good or should I switch back to my um Canon Rebel but then again I actually got a microphone for my Canon Rebel and I got a new Canon Rebel it's the Re Canon Rebel T6i I feel like I said Rebel at least seven times in the past 10 seconds but yeah once I start filming regular videos once Vlogmas is over I'm definitely gonna go switch back to that probably won't end up using this that often unless I do a vlog or two but for the most part I don't think I'm gonna be using this just because it's like the same weight as a Rebel but like maybe a couple ounces lighter so yeah, that's basically how my day has been going. I hope your day has been going by splendidly. Wow, that was a lot. But yeah, in school, what happened today in school? Mm, I had a calc test, like second calc test um, back to back. Because the first day was calculator and then the second day was no calculator, which was interesting. So yeah really like this is my everyday vlogs one of you guys i think on my turkish channel really they commented saying these aren't vlogs like you're not going outside you're not doing stuff and i'm like you guys wanted me to do vlogmas i asked you guys on twitter and on instagram if you wanted me to do vlogmas and i don't think a single person said no so i mean this is my everyday life i'm not gonna create this whole fantasy life for you guys this is my everyday life what i do when i get home from school um, but usually today I would have my literary club, um, but that was canceled for this week, so, but usually I am doing something. 